Uh, Joe Bond reports live. I'm here at the Lockhart Water Tower mural. Now, this massive big water tower has been painted depicting a cascading waterfall surrounded by flora, fauna, and to the local landscape, which reflects the importance of one of Australia's most talented, vital assets, which is water. Now, it's a real shame that this beautiful water tower is actually covered by trees. And you can't see some of the most beautiful paintings. Anyway, the incredible artwork was designed by talented Blue Mountains artist Scott Nagy and Crimson, or Jane Berkner, who applied more than 600 square metres of undercoat to the surface, to the tower, prior to painting the mural using natural complements of the historic artist artscape from Lockhart. The freehand artwork took two weeks to complete. Working from images just off their mobiles, the artist used spray cans and a spray gun to outline the elements and then detailed the mural. There's a rosella, a willy wagtail, a kookaburra, uh, magpies, there's a possum, an echidna, a mob of kangaroos lazing under the shady tree. And this was done in 2018. So I'm just going to give you a quick tour because you kind of can't see much. The sun's really glary today. And it's designed... Should be council buildings. There's a beautiful possum up there, but you can't see it because of the glare of the sun. You've got some ducks. Look at the rosella, see? Stunning. Galaz. Oh, and if you go right out here up to the top, you can actually see. Oh, please come on. Can you see the, like the brogas right up the top? Anyway, Joe Bond checking out. I wanted to come to Lockhart to see the water tower, and I have officially done it. Yeehaw. Joe Bond and Brie Gill checking out live.